Hi everybody, this is Patrick from Doggy Dashboard and today I'm going to show you the newest feature which is called Hybrid Calendar. So here on the home page you'll see the normal calendar which is the weekly view here and we can see we have uh, four daycare appointments on the 7th from 8 a.m. till 6 p.m. We have a groom here at 8.15 to 10.15. Today we have some daycare tomorrow. It looks like we have two training appointments from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. and then there's an open grooming slot from 10 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. on Friday, December 11th. So these are your non-kennel appointments. Now if we want to go to see your kennel appointments, we need to go up here to view, come down to the kennel calendar, and now you'll be able to see your kennel appointments. These are the appointments that are kennel based. And so we have Peaches in Kennel 1, Denver in Kennel 2, Winston in Kennel 3, and there's a cat named Lincho in uh, our cat kennel. And so if I want to see both my homepage uh, appointments and my kennel appointments, I have to go back and forth. Well, the newest feature called Hybrid Calendar is actually going to fix all that and it'll have all of your appointments on the same calendar. To get started, just go up here to the little wrench icon. Go to business settings and click that and then go to the calendar settings option which is the second option uh, click there and here the last question it says which calendar do you want displayed on your home page we're going to select the option hybrid there's standard hybrid and kennel that will show up when you click on it we're going to go and do update settings and now our settings have been updated we go back to the home page and now if we scroll down, you'll see that this calendar shows both appointments. On the top, we have, once again, our four daycare appointments. But then if you go down below, you'll see that your kennel layout is there and all your kennel appointments are showing up. So this will make it much easier for you to keep track of uh, who's coming in for, let's say, a grooming appointment, but also who's sleeping in your kennels. Uh, I would say this only works for businesses that do kennel based um, boarding. If you don't have pre-made kennels at your business, you really don't need to use the kennel calendar at all. You can just use simple boarding appointments up here on the, the top calendar. Uh, and either way, just to show you how you create an appointment, um, if you want to create an appointment inside a kennel, you simply just click on the kennel. Let's uh, put a dog in here and kennel four on December 8th. You can see it pre-populates kennel four. We're going to put in a dog named Luna. And she's going to come in from the 8th until the 11th, and we'll schedule that appointment. Close this down, and you can see there from the 8th to the 11th, Luna is in kennel 4. And if we want to add an appointment that isn't kennel based, let's add a grooming appointment here on the 10th. We just click here on the date. You can see that the kennel option is not showing up. We're going to put our old friend Peaches there. And Peaches is going to get a spa day appointment from 9 a.m. until 11 a.m. Schedule that appointment. And there you go. Peaches from 9 a.m. to 11 p.m. has a spa day appointment. So that is the new hybrid calendar. It should make it very simple for you to quickly see who's coming in for kennel appointments, who's coming in for non-kennel appointments, and it should just make Doggy Dashboard much better all around. Thank you very much. Have a great December. Have a Merry Christmas, a Happy Holidays, and thank you again. Bye.